and this is Worms Coachella Monday. But before we get started, I think Worm got sick. You know the herpes that's going around, 11,000 people. So we're gonna pray for Worm. What's good, what's good, what's good, bro? Worm. <laughs> Yo, what happened to you, bro? You alright? I'm good, bro. You like that, you like that Coachella, man. Yeah, you heard what happened, right? What happened? 11,000 people, that's what happened. <laughs> <laughs> this place is mad, brother. Word. Uh, reported that 11,000 people got herpes at Coachella is actually fake. We'll get more into the details in a little bit. So welcome to today's video. If you're new to our channel, we make a brand new Coachella video every single Monday. Today we feature the legendary Billy Dale. Kid. A thousand one hundred people in LA, San Diego, and the Coachella Valley were looking up the symptoms for herpes. But according to the Eisenhower Hospital, the health department, and the local Planned Parenthood in the Coachella Valley, only about two hundred and fifty people actually reached out for treatment, and the rest of them were just random searches like prevention and stuff. So that was actually a fake story. And now people think everybody at Coachella got herpes because people just want to hate on Coachella because they couldn't go to Coachella. But stop hating. Appreciate it. We got the number one festival in the valley. The world, bro. In California. In the world. I ain't gonna say that, bro. I ain't gonna lie. It's, it's in the world. Bro. I ain't gonna lie. Rolling loud, man. Rolling loud. I rolling loud's got no hologram. Tupac, Beyonce, Destiny's Child, Outcast Reunion. <laughs> <laughs> Now let's move on to the predictions for 2020. I know Coachella just ended, so who's gonna come to Coachella 2020? We need yeah. J. Cole, man. So, uh, we need I, I J. Cole. I feel like J. Cole needs to come to Coachella. He could be a perfect headliner. He's never played at the festival. He has an enormous fan base. Badass music. I've seen him twice live, man. So I mean, he's so real and pure, like energy. It's crazy, though. Thanks for him being at Coachella. He's never been to Coachella. Has that kind of following where he could be a headliner. Another one that I can see coming back is Drake, 2015. He had one of a, a forgettable performance, to say the least. Yeah, 2014. But now he's had like three or four years of nothing but hits every summer, just yeah. like all kinds of songs. Like yeah. I'm I hate on Drake because I don't like him personally. He's so super. It's my God. So I'm, I'm not a huge fan of Drake, but he does have amazing songs. They're super catchy. He's he loves writing. He's a hitman. He got all the hits. It's all the hits. Yeah. So it, the him hits. coming back to Coachella would be amazing. Now look, I'm gonna give you three headlines right now. J Cole, Travis Scott, Drake. That is solid, but it's all hip hop though. It's all hip hop. I feel like it has to be at least one like band or. There's been a rumor every year um, for someone like Metallica to come to Coachella, hard metal, but mm -hmm. they are like a legendary band. Twenty One Pilot. Twenty One Pilot. Twenty One Pilot has a huge. Too, oh, so it'd be cool to have somebody like 21 Pilot. To be honest, right now it's a little bit early. This is just got our predictions. J. Cole, Drake, Travis Scott, 21 Justin Pilot. Justin Timberlake. That's very interesting you say Justin Timberlake because he was supposed to be a headliner this year, but he had to get vocal cord surgery, so he dropped out. But they did bring out NSYNC without him because he's still recovering from him. NSYNC, not NSYNC without Timberlake. Okay. For sure. JT might come out next year. Even Solange, she dropped out of this year's Coachella. Uh, there was some production. Um, Mishaps, so I could see her coming back for 2020 since she couldn't perform this year. So. I need Meek Mill though, too. Meek Mill? Meek Mill would be cool. Like, what about Billy Dale? Oh, I'm for sure gonna be there. Yeah, yeah, we 20, gotta man. get Billy Dale on the card, but like whatever. Bro, I gotta it takes. Get me if you haven't checked out his music, one of my intros used to be his song, Biano's. Miliano. This is his main intro. Me and Kate. Oh, yeah. And then Miliano. Check out our podcast with Billy Dale. We had a couple podcasts on here, and he's always dropping fire music, so make sure you guys follow this man on Instagram. Let us know in the comments who do you guys wanna see at Coachella 2020, where we're standing right now. Like we said, Drake has a possibility. J. Cole, Travis Scott, 21 Pilot. So let us know in the comments who you guys want to see next year. At the Sahara stage, there was these giant like balloons that were swinging because there was a lot of wind and one of them fell on top of a girl and she was knocked down unconscious at the festival. There hasn't been a lot of reports about it because Coachella likes to keep all the negativity like under wraps. But she is suing the festival. She's she's, she's gonna get her bag. So she damn sure gonna get a bag. She's gonna get her bag, so it kinda sucks though. I actually have some footage. I don't know if it was some of the ones I lost, but I had some footage when we were waiting for Kid Cudi. Like, those things were moving like crazy, and I was like, I even told Alex, like, that shit looks like it's gonna fall. Also, one more thing, I made a predictions video about Coachella, like, a couple months back. Now we're gonna kick off the potential surprise guest with Jaden Smith. Now, Jaden Smith, he barely started rapping not so long ago, and there's a possibility that the legendary Will Smith will show up. There's potentials that somebody like 2 Chains could come out with YG. Cardi B is gonna come out with other performers because there's a lot of potentials come out as a special guest performer I think three different times in his Coachella career and you can't have a Coachella 20th anniversary without Kanye West So, you know, 
you never know so these these predictions might come true and again if we get more news and more updates i'll be, be making more videos comments what do you guys want to see about coachella i have a lot of coachella videos coming up for the rest of the year next week's video is going to be how to buy a bracelet for coachella 2020 so if you're looking forward to going to coachella 2020 subscribe and don't miss a video now so, remember trojan man is your best friend <laughs> if you didn't catch herpes at Coachella this year, or if you did catch herpes at Coachella this year, like just prepare next time. Like, don't be sharing drinks with random strangers. Don't be sharing blunts. Don't be sharing blunts. Don't be kissing like, random ass people. Don't be kissing on random ass people. <laughs> Good for today's video, guys. Go. <laughs> that's it. And that's always. See you at Coachella. Be there 2020.